Hello. Well, I'm, I want to just uh, talk about uh, basically my book that I wrote, um, and I talked a bit about uh, uh, last November. <clears throat> um, it's available uh, in paperback now. Um, you know, Amazon uh, offers a, a way for people to buy paperback books uh, if people order them. Like if you every time it's uh, somebody places an order, it'll be printed and then uh, sent to you wherever you live. I have it so it's international. Um, now, one thing about this is um, some days ago now when this went live, but um, you know there's a 72-hour waiting period from when that you uh, put the file through Amazon's. Um, uh, a system of where you can uh, upload books and stuff, uh, and um, when uh, you know you have the option of having it be an ebook or paperback, and I kind of actually wanted it to be paperback. Um, uh, after so many months of it being uh, available as an ebook. Um, and also, I was looking for other places where I could possibly get it to, like, a, into various uh, stores with that possibility also. Like Barnes & Noble, you know, here in America. Um, maybe North America overall, but, you know, you know, bookstores, websites for bookstores, things of that nature. Um, haven't had really much luck outside of Amazon, so I kind of waited, and, you know, I thought now, you know, next month will be six months since I, uh, released my book, and I thought it'd be a good time to finally have it to where you can, uh, people can buy a physical copy of it, uh, if you like, um, and that takes 72 hours, as I said, um, but in that time, you know, I initially had it at, uh, six uh, 663, and now it's 963 afterwards, so I guess from the time I, uh, submitted it originally, and, uh, it went live, I went to double check that it was, uh, listed for international, uh, to be sold internationally, so people, viewers who may not live in America, you know, could get it, you know, like specifically outside of North America. Um, it, granted, I know there is a Canadian uh, Amazon and a Mexican Amazon website and stuff where you can buy things, but it would seem like if you just went to Amazon.com and you live in either of those countries, it'd probably be easier to obtain whatever you're buying from like, I guess, the American version as opposed to which, whatever your native uh, country is, or at least where you're living, even if where you might live, maybe for work purposes, or if you're, you know, like in the military, you're stationed somewhere else, um, so on. So, I just wanted to make sure that you could, people could have, be able to order the book wherever, and it is in English, so, you know, I not able to really translate into other uh, languages. Don't really know any other languages, so that's one reason. But you know, that's uh, I thought it was a bit unfortunate because I had it as the bare minimum you could set it as because I thought you know, I don't want it to be too high, and especially for my first book. Um, and while I don't know if I will, you know, make another book. I don't want to say I never will, but, you know, on the off chance that I do, depending on the length of it and whatever the kind of book it would be, maybe increasing it a bit more, uh, especially for, you know, uh, uh, paperback would be a bit more pricey, obviously. Um, but I thought the six uh, sixty-three, six dollars $6.00. The 63 cents was actually a pretty good price for it, but 
I don't know, I have no control over Amazon, what they do. The uh, times certain things are, I guess, set at a certain minimum. Sometimes that raises and sometimes that lowers. Um, maybe some time from now it will lower again and I'll be able to lower it a bit. Um, I know I won't be able to get as much royalties for it, but you know, I want it to be as affordable as it can be as the lowest you could possibly get it. So, even though I think it's a bit of a shame that it wasn't at its, the original price I wanted it, it is uh, 963 um, still uh, 299 for the ebook. Um, uh, I, have, I haven't ordered mine yet because I can order copies for myself. Uh, and I could give some to, as gifts, I guess, if I wanted to. Um, but I just wanted to let people know, whoever is interested, uh, you know, it's a Western. Uh, it's my first book. It's like a revenge story, essentially, which I kind of thought would be a, a pretty good story for, like, a Western. That's, I think, in many ways, sort of uh, a trope that's... Fairly common, you know. It's not only in every western, you know. You know, there's gunfights and all. I have heard that the the, the gunfights and stuff in the book was a bit confusing at times. Of course, me being the author and the editor, I you know, and when I'm editing, I'm making sure to get rid of as much stuff that is just sort of filler and add certain things where necessary and. You know, I never thought there was any problem, but then again, I'm the author. I'm the guy who wrote it, so my perspective may not be the most reliable. But you know, I I also sort of uh, did this sort of unannounced because I kind of wanted it to be kind of a surprise. I didn't want to tell many people. I told very few people, and uh, yeah, I uh, yeah I. <clears throat> I'm happy with the book. Uh, overall, I uh, I'm just glad I'm able to be able to finally put it out on paperback. I, I thought after a while it was kind of time to do that, um, and so uh, now nah. probably ha uh, hopefully I can do this for um, hopefully for my birthday next month I'll be able to you know have a discount of sorts so that people want to buy it hopefully they'll be able to have some sort of percentage off I don't know exactly what I haven't looked into that for paperback um, I know for you can go at, at least at the very minimum of free for like your you know your uh, <clears throat> uh, uh, ebook for like a oh, five days I don't know if they would do that for, you know, paperback or not. You know, I would, I wouldn't imagine so. Probably couldn't get that for free, but if it's a, but maybe I could get the ebook for free again for people who might like the ebook prefer that. But for those who like physical copies, such as I do, uh, clearly for movies, I do. I also have books up on top shelves. Um, yes, I, uh, I like, uh, I prefer physical copies. Sometimes I'm not able to always get them, so sort of like more convenient able to just buy a digital copy always with the intention of you know buying physical later if I'm not able to do it right away so hopefully um, you know this is good news you know this is good news for those who if you've read my book um, as an ebook and you like it uh, you're able to you know if you thought it was good, you may want to have a physical copy of it to read. If you can do so now. Or if you uh, haven't read it, um, you know it's a book, uh, and the, the description of it. Oh, what did I write again? Oh, I just had it.
Yeah, you can, yeah, it's a revenge story. Uh, guy goes into a, he's been traveling around looking for specific people, uh, and as the course of the book goes on, you find out that uh, you find out exactly why he's, you know, after these specific people and has traveled you know, quite a bit. You know, it's called the Wandering Sheriff, and you find out why. You know that is because the dude has a sheriff ba sheriff's badge that he's wearing. Um, is he really a sheriff? Was he a sheriff? Well, you'll have to read, read the book. Um, he's a bounty hunter, so maybe he was a sheriff at one point, and now, because of these guys, he's just going to go after them. Uh, you know, and the only way he would be able to legally. Um, so, you know, yeah, this is a... This book is available in uh, paperback if you order it um so again uh price is 990 or 963 uh, american dollar so of course you know uh, it, that's going to vary uh, country to country um you should be able to put in your uh, the country your that you live in and uh at least what will allow you to where you can buy it, and then from there, like UK or uh, Canada, Mexico, Japan. Uh, I'm trying to think as many international places as my audience could be, um, and so you know, uh, my audience for this channel. So you know, you can. You know, take that into consideration. Um, hopefully, my for my birthday, I'll be able to have a discount of sorts, so people are will be able to if they want to buy it uh, at a lower cost, and uh, hopefully, I'll be able to have the ebook for free also. Um, I don't know about the paperback if that's also for five days, like a five day. Uh, so so much percent off, like uh, 30, 50 percent off or so, and you can buy it, and um, that can last for like five days, just like the ebook, or if that could be a bit longer, um, you know, I don't know. So, you know, uh, if you've read it, you you might have a idea of if you'd like to own a copy of it physically, and if you haven't, uh, you know, uh, if you haven't uh, gotten the ebook version and you're just hearing this now for the first time, like you're for your new subscriber or just coming across my channel, um, yeah, just letting you know um, about this. So, um, yeah, what? Uh, just want you to have as many options as possible if you like paperback physical copies don't have that you just like a ebook and get that or if you like both you can get both um, yeah it's up to you or you don't have to buy it uh, that's always an option also um, but yeah uh, I just wanted to let you all know about that and I hope you're having a great week Hope your day has been great, and I hope you'll have a great weekend coming up, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.